Selamat malam, Bukan. Okay, good morning everyone. Well, it's quite early in the morning. We're out trying to avoid the heat because it's been jolly warm middays recently. So, um, just want to talk through what we're doing, what's happened since I last spoke to you. Uh, first thing that's happened is that I've filled those routed slots. If, Hazel, if you can just show that. I just took two fills, I think maybe three fills. Filled it first of all with epoxy and microfibers, first two fills, and then a very thin coat, as you see that brown stuff there, that's, a, that's epoxy with microspheres, I believe, a you know, very light sandable. So um, if you're thickening epoxy, you've got various options. You've got the one that I use mostly is microfibers. That's good for um, gluing and, and hard, strong filling. Um, Another option you've got is chop fibres, which are about six millimetre long fibres you can mix in. It's what the Canadians used to call when you mixed it in with epoxy for, for filling big areas. I say the Canadians used to call it bear poop. I didn't say poop. Um, you've got, so you've got chop fibres, you've got microfibres, which are really short fibres, I say good for gluing and, and strong filling. You've got um, microspheres and micro balloons, both of which are quite sandable, so much, much easier to sand. So if, if it's somewhere like here, like that top skim there that I wanted to sand flat afterwards, I've used those microspheres in that. Um, good, so that's done and sanded and smooth. I coated the hull with another coat of epoxy with the, with the little four inch roller, just, just pure epoxy. Uh, and sanded the entire hull. So that's where we are. And then what you've just seen, you saw me put in the six inch tape, glass tape in epoxy around the chine. 
And then, of course, when that dried, I ran around with the sander and gave it a quick sand over, smoothed it up, brushed it all off to get rid of as much dust as I could. And what we're about to do is we're about to get out the meter wide cloth and uh, roll it out, cut it to length, and then put a, well, the goal today is to get the bottom cloth sheathed in glass cloth and epoxy. So that's what you're about to see. Good, you just put a hand up there and catch that. Good people can see how we do this. <laughs> Up again though. Um, yeah, watch out the camera. I'm leaving it standing alone here to get the iPad to make some pictures. Take a good yeah. Action from here. I know it was shaky before. Yeah. Oh, so, a new tub. This green thing is wicked. What's wicked? The green thing. I 
right now I feel like one of those professional uh, photographers that always have like two or three cameras yeah, around their neck. Very, very professional. Mm. So I think we're ready to rock and roll.
Yeah, it looks flat.
Yes, in the sunset, stand there to see. Tell me where you're going so decisively. What's your destination? Tell me where you're bound. We can move together where adventures abound. Running free before the breeze. 